I never ever will, and now you all know why. Are you sure you're not supposed to be at the Congress or what? Did you hear that? Okay, I think I'm blushing now. I haven't done that in a while. Good job, good job. Okay, we've got the Urban Mage. Steampunk Captain Raven. We have the Steampunk Fairy, Nimoy. We have the Barbarian Lord. And the Lady of the Flame. Okay, honey? All right. Now, <laughs> all right. So, question, ladies and gentlemen, should I ham this up a little bit or is the anticipation killing you yet? <laughs> Thank you. Problems from the peanut gallery. Okay, for our fourth, fourth place winner, we have the Lady of the Flame. For our third place winner, we have Diana Grave. And here's where I get to my point of the conclusion of sorts. We have a tie for one and two. I actually looked at the numbers, there is actually a tie. So, if we can have the Squire of Rohan and the Steampunk Fairy join us up front. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to decide this by applaud. They will both be considered winners of this contest. They will both have to share the banner, which will make some pretty sort of hilarious uh, photographs. <laughs> 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 oh, look, like we do have uh, two banners, actually. But there's only one tiara. But there's only one tiara. <laughs> 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 All right, it'll be decided. So does the guy get the tiara, and does the girl already have enough space on her head for one thing? <laughs> All right, so we're going to decide this by applause. So for those who would like the winner of the contest to be the Squire Graham, please applaud. Fairy is losing her sash, which is another fine way to get uh, applause, I must <laughs> 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 
who would like to have the steampunk fairy win this one? Guys, I'm not convinced. Squire? <laughs> okay, it looks like you both get a sash, but a sash, but it looks like the squire is not going to have to wear the girly hair. <laughs> the girly thing, otherwise known as the, what was the coronet, the tiara, whatever. We have the Celestial Starburst 2009 winner, Esther, in the Italian da, Ren. This is what she da, wore last year. Da, it is beautiful and beaded. Yeah. You see, back in other contests like this, they usually hand over the crown, don't they? So we could actually have two. <laughs> All right, congrats. What? Oh wait, is that the, is that the sound of a speech I started here? Oh, Sweetie, you don't have an emo reason to cry this time. I only want the world peace. <laughs> yes, but do you know where all the states in the United States happen to be? Okay, that was too much of a joke. Never mind. mind. Alright. Anyways, this concludes our contest for 2010. I see you. Hold, on, hold that thought for a minute. And I'd love to thank all of you for coming. Congratulations to all of our contestants. You have done a fine job this year. And I see a young man who wants to show off his football shirt. They breathe out fire like your mom,